Now, your exclusive Storm Team forecast from KTVO. Well, good Saturday evening to your heartland. We had some windy conditions today, but those are going to die off over our overnight hours. Looking in Kirksville right now, 43 degrees, mostly clear conditions. Feels like 39 with winds out of the south at 7 miles per hour. In Ottumwa, it's 46. Feels like 41. Winds out of the south as well at 11 miles per hour. Mostly clear conditions in the city of Bridges. As the regional satellite goes 3D, you can see we didn't really have any cloud cover today due to the winds coming through, but it was very gusty out there giving those high profile vehicles a run for their money on the road. But as you can see, everything mostly clear, but we are going to see some showers move in from the southwest. Overnight tonight, we're going to see some increasing clouds, a low of 38 degrees. Winds are going to be from the south, southwest, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Putting the future cast in motion, you're going to see these line of storms that are going to come up from Texas over Kansas. The yellow and the orange spots are going to be the thunderstorms. And you can see over in the late afternoon to evening hours, you're going to see those roll through Kirksville and then through Ottumwa by 10 p.m. Shouldn't be anything severe, but we will definitely keep an eye on it for you overnight. And just to let you know, daylight savings time starts at 2 a.m. Don't forget to turn your clocks ahead one hour so you aren't one hour behind. And also change your carbon monoxide and smoke detectors as well. Tomorrow morning, 39 degrees, and by 10 a.m., 45, and that's when we will start to see the rain come into the heartland. By tomorrow afternoon, we are going to see some showers and thunderstorms, a high of 58 degrees, winds out of the south, 10 to 15 miles per hour, and gusts up to 30 miles per hour. Tomorrow night, we will see some more showers. Those will persist. We could see a half of inch of rain throughout the entire day, a low of 41 degrees. Winds will be out of the south still, and we will still see those gusty winds at 25 miles per hour. Putting the surface map in motion, this is where all of our storms are coming from, and those will move off through the heartland by Monday morning. But you can see we're going to see still see a few precipitation there, but then look off towards our west. You can see over the Gulf of Alaska and off the Pacific Northwest a lot of snow and rain that could be heading our way depending on how the jet stream acts. Here's your exclusive Storm Team 3 five-day forecast, and as you can see tomorrow, our high is going to be 58 degrees on Monday 68, but as we look throughout the week we're going to see partly sunny conditions all the way until next weekend and those overnight lows are also increasing so we're not going to see those freezing temperatures anymore don't forget to get your forecast 24 7 at heartlandconnection.com